going guys? My name is Coach Child Dogs the Ball, Bob Bill for Theme Park News, and welcome to a Theme Park News update from Trips Drill. Now this is on their two Vacoma coasters opening at the park in the 2020 season. We've got names, we've got themes, we've got descriptions from their official Facebook post confirming the coasters, and some concept art to share with you on your screen now. It's going to be a jam-packed, action-packed video. Now if you've loved our content, make sure you like the video if you've loved it. Comment your thoughts down below and make sure if you want to keep up to date with the latest content, click the notification bell and subscribe to Coast Shell YouTube channel so you never miss any more thrilling content. And now let's zoom into the video. So this is from Tripstrill. This is a European park. We know that they've, they've been considering coasters. We know they've been doing coasters for a while. Um, now the story begins in this year, 2019, when we thought we were going to get a coaster from Vacoma this year, or rumoured of Vacoma coaster this year, and then another one in 2020. However, that doesn't seem to be the case. Now they're all being both are being constructed for 2020. So one is a Vacoma family boomerang. So you look at something like uh, Savon that's being constructed at Far Up Summerland, uh, Benton Ultimate Mission, now known as Accelerator at Drayton Manor here in the UK, or Velociraptor in the Lost Kingdom area at Poulton's Park. Then you've got this new concept called a suspended thrill coaster, again by Vacoma, the Dutch manufacturer. So the suspended thrill coaster, we've done a video on that already. Make sure you go check that in the theme park newsroom playlist. That was the new Vacoma concepts we were talking about early on in the channel's history uh, when that was announced back at IAPA last year, 2018 IAPA. Can't believe I'm saying that now. Um, but basically, the suspended thrill coaster is like they've moved away from the suspended looping coaster and sort of created a bit of a newer version known as the STC. So we've got rid of the SLC and it's now the STC and the SFC, the suspended family coaster, which is you fly at the Pterosaur at Poulton's Park, uh, Fun Spot America's got one, uh, you've got um, Dragonfly in the Wild World Grove section of Dollywood uh, that opened recently. So, you know, you've got these kind of models, but this is like the thrill coaster. So, you're taking the suspended family coaster with the newer Gen Vacoma track and the trains, but you're adding a couple of inversions in there. That is what. To, that's what the two coasters trips drill are adding next year so big underrated projects in my opinion we've got names we've got themes and we've also got stories as spoke about on social media from trips drill so let's have a look at those themes and stories right now so the first coaster there so we're going to talk about the uh family vacoma boomerang first so this is their official description so they've got two train emojis uh this is from facebook by the way in the design of the family roller coaster uh and then four emoji faces where it goes downhill not only forward, but also in the backward shots, bit of a reverse emoji. We have been reminded by one of the most famous Swabian folk songs, Get Inspired, namely by the Swabian Railway, another train emoji. So basically they're going with the Swabian theme with both of these, if you want a bit of a teaser. Um, and I think Swabian themes are definitely in Tripstrel's uh, bloodstream. They're really used to doing Swabian themes, so I think they're going back to their old roots and really getting in that Swabian theme again. In the song that was created at the end of the 19th century, a turbulent journey is sung on the Swabian Railway. The roller coaster is designed in the style of a steam locomotive. In addition, we've chosen the name Full Steam for the new attraction. Now, there is a German version of the name, uh, Volendampf, I think it's pronounced in German. Something like that. But in English, we're calling it Full Steam. So, Full Steam is a very good name for this coaster. And I'm really excited to see what Full Steam could bring as it goes full steam ahead. Ah, uh, get the joke? I don't either. Uh, now, the th now we've got a rabbit. We've got two rabbit emojis for the next one. The thematization of the suspended thrill coaster dates back to the Seven Swabia, a narrative that's been rooted in the Swabian country for hundreds of years. The Seven Swabians once set themselves the goal of tracking down a terrifying monster armed with a lance, bit of a detective emoji, and then a gender emoji. The new roller coaster will therefore bear the name Neck Overhead. With this naming, we refer not only to the Rush Hero stories of the Seven Swabia, but also to the four so called overhead elements, in brackets, roll ashes, upside down happy face emoji, which the unique selling features of this new prototype are. So, I'm very excited about that. Now, the name Neck Overhead in English might not sound impressive. We, some of us English enthusiasts are probably commenting down below right now thinking, Neck Overhead, not a very good name in English. But I think because it's a German uh, name and it's a German park, um, 
you got to think, you know, it, it sounds better in German. I think with the full Steam one, it sounds better in both languages, but I think with this one, it specifically sounds better in German. I can't remember what the German one was. Comment down below if you know for certain, but it sort of went over my head. But the, ne the, the, the neck overhead English name sounds a bit, eh. But I think it sounds better in German. I think that's what they were going for with this one. So, um... I've got no complaints with that one. So I think they're both really good names. So you've got one theme to uh, the heroic stories of the Seven Swabi along with the unique selling point of the four inversions or overhead elements as they call them in the Facebook post. Then you've got the other one themed to a, a steam train like a full steam locomotive based around uh, that was theme, that was sort of seen around the 19th century Swabi and Sock. So very interesting themes and stories and names to go for. But I think it's definitely in Tripstrol's um, bloodstream to go with those types of themes and names. So I can't, can't I can't complain. They're really good, really good Swabian themes, very different themes for coasters, and I'm really excited about this project. So please comment down below your thoughts, and I'll reply to every single comment. You know I do. But for now, guys, thank you very much for watching this theme park news update. Like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. And for now, guys, my name is Ghost Joe. Keep on the coast of life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care. Have an awesome day, my friends.